Hey, oh, there's a couple here. Wait, what's going on? <laughs> is that one licking the other one? <laughs> this is industrial petting, not heavy petting. Didn't know they'd be petting each other. I thought that'd only be me. Well, you can stop that now and follow me to your resting place in the elevator. Hi there, and welcome to Industrial Petting. So, this game's been on my list for a while, and I finally found some time to check it out. Now, the game is in early access, so there will be more developments to come, but they've already added quite a lot to it since it was released in March, so I think there's still plenty of content to come in time. Now, basically, Industrial Petting feels like a bit of a mashup between Slime Rancher and Satisfactory. The objective of the game is to acquire pets from this planet we're on, manufacturing them in machinery that we build. Then you follow the instructions here. So acquire a pet, get it to love you, which is the heart. Then you vacuum it up into this pipe system and fire it off into the sky in the space elevator. And you do that for rewards like getting you tech. That all making sense? Good out. So before we can start manufacturing our own pets, we kind of need to steal a few from their natural habitat first. So here's our first cuddly friend. So we give it a prod with the mechanical arm here. And apparently it loves me now, so it will follow me back. Come on. Yep, that's it, follow me. And we'll go back to the elevator. That's it, over there. Come on, come on. And we just suck it up into the vacuum. There you go. No, 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 you've missed it. Go on, go back, go back. That's it, in in there. <laughs> there we go. Safe and sound in its tube and it's safely stored in the space elevator for later. Right, let's go find some more. Now, what I forgot to say is I need to set contracts so that we've got a reason for putting them in the space elevator. So if we set a contract for a pet assembler, that means up in the corner here, it'll tell me how many of those little creatures we need to suck up in the vacuum to get that tech. So, okay. Hello. What are you then? <laughs> well, smiley face. Can I do anything with you? Right. Obviously, I played a little bit of this in the tutorial, but haven't met these green creatures yet. Aha, second victim. I mean, pet. Here we go. Nice and cuddly. You're going to follow me now. Ooh, carrots. Now, these, I think, we use for feeding the creatures later on. Not quite sure yet, but I may as well pick up what I can on my way to find the piglets. Hey, oh, there's a couple here. Wait, what's going on? <laughs> is that one licking the other one? <laughs> this is industrial petting, not heavy petting. Didn't know they'd be petting each other. I thought that'd only be me. Well, you can stop that now and follow me to your resting place in the elevator. So that's three more piggies. Should be plenty to fulfill the contract if they'll go in the elevator. There we go. And down they go into the chute. Woo, lift off. Well, that was fun. Congratulations on your first export. You should use your profits to buy some new blueprints and not at all feel guilty about tricking little piglets into a space journey they didn't ask for. Yeah, I'm sure they're fine. Let's see what's in the shop then. So, oh no, that's items, contracts. Where's the shop? Is this the shop? A, ooh, fence or a cuddler hat. Fence recipe. Oh, set another export. Cool. Okay. Right. Well, that's a bit more. Oh, I've got some work to do. Now, because I fulfilled the other contract, we should be able to build this pet assembler now. So, now what do we do to get that? Just click on it. Uh, yeah. Okay. Where are we going to put this? Hmm. Now, I'm assuming this is going to drop them on the floor. Or do I? Do they go straight into the machine? No, that wouldn't make sense. So, oh, <laughs> rotating a bit. I will figure this out. Right, it's down. I think I was too close to the elevator. So it's down here, a little bit away from it. Next step is putting down one of these vacuum tube things so that when the pets get dropped out of the producer, they go straight up into the tube and straight into the elevator. It's getting a bit dark here. Must be going into nighttime. Okay, so if we click on here, now this will show us what the pet assembler does. So change the recipe. 
And we only have the recipe for cutlers, which needs green goo. And I know what that green goo is. So all we need is two green goo to make a cuddler, and that's this little fellow over here. So how do we get the green goo? Well, harvester. And this little dude, it just goes and like picks bits of goo off it. I mean, it's rather adorable, but you know, does that not hurt? I'm just chipping away at your backside there. No, well, they're still smiling, so it can't, it can't hurt that much. Now it's time for the pipes. So we get a little pipe here, connector, and that connects up from the green goo. Gonna need another one. So try and position it so it's nice and neat. Although I think this is gonna end up a massive mess by the time we finish. So that's it, make another junction, and in you go. One more here. Try and position it nicely. Easy does it. And that connects right up. So, there we go. Got some, got the green goo now going into the machine. And that should be producing little, well, they're called cuddlers, but I'm still going to call them piglets. Because they look, look like piglets to me. And this thing, that's not, that's, I've got that in the wrong place. Because that pipe, I don't need the piglets to go into there, so I think we can, yeah, get rid of that one. And then this one just needs another set of pipes that connects that with the space elevator. Just noticed our first factory produced piglet. Come here. Have a bit of a mechanical cuddling. And there you go, into the pipe. Yay! There we go. Oh, more. Another one. Wow, they produce quickly. Right, you two, in you go. Still got a load of these things to... Go on, back with you. There we go. So, it does produce them quite quickly. But, you know, I think I'm going to need a few more of these if we're going to get anywhere, like, soonish. Because that's going to take forever if we've got more contracts that are coming up like this. Get back here, damn pig. Where do you think you're going? No, into the machine. Come on, come on back. Come on, yay. Do you think maybe it's a little bit cruel that these things are just getting born? Prod them a little bit with the mechanical arm and they get in the tube with you. You go into another land. Poor piglets, they trust me. I I guess nothing bad's gonna happen to them. In the Piper Mysteries. Right, next job is to find way more of these piggies because we've still got 15 to go before we can build a fence. And the machine is pumping new ones out at an alarming rate. And well, without fencing, they're free to wander off wherever they want into the wild. Can't be having that, can we? So more piggies to catch. I've been out hunting and I'm going to say this is enough now. Yeah, I went out pretty far into the forest and just gathered as many piggies as I could find. Been collecting this water when I can as well. Oh Lord, Ooh, they've been breeding. They've been breeding while I'm not here. Ah, don't run away, get in. Don't, come, come and be cuddled. That's it, come and be cuddled, just like you want. Now, into the thing. Oh, where, do, where are you going? Oh, don't run away. Follow me into the machine. That's it. All of you in the machine with you. <laughs> oh dear, that's a lot. That is an awful lot of them. Don't don't all crowd. This is plenty of room for everyone. And that is our second contract. <gasps> don't don't fall over. So second contract done. I can now build the fence. Fence is built and piggies are safely trapped inside, so I can go out and do other stuff without fear of them wandering around everywhere. Now, next on my to-do list is to build this factory. And do I need a contract for that? There should be. Ah, uh, there we go. Set us export, so that needs some kind of green cuddler. I don't know what that is. So don't think can we I don't I don't know what that green one is. It's like, it's like a normal cuddler with something green on its back. Hmm. I'm going to have to look into this. Right, I've been out wandering and I found a green one. Apparently it's a fossilised one. 
so <laughs> it's got like green goo on its back and apparently that makes it fossilized so just need to collect a few more of these and we can fulfill this contract there we go nice prodding for you and is that another one ah two of them nice uh stuck in the wood come on oh don't fall over sometimes you knock them over like that no nope, come on come on both of you i'm having both of these green ones right all you guys follow me still following me good because this little piggy went all the way to the vacuum tube right in you go then don't all crowd at once plenty of room for everyone you seem to be getting the hang of this. Slime cuddlers are going to be the hottest new pet on the market. Slime cuddlers have more complicated production than normal cuddlers. Missing the launch because of this. So, gonna need to add normal cuddlers to the machine as well as goo, and then we get green goo ones? Let's find out. Alright, so I've added another pet producer. There you go in there. And the original one I've set up to make the green ones. So these ones go into there. Just get this one as well. So yeah, these ones go into this original vacuum tube and that's now piped up to the original pet producer. And I've also got the goo piped up to there or to both of them, I should say. And there we go. We're making green goo cuddlers now. And I've set up another vacuum tube behind it and they just go straight up there. It's not the most efficient right now. I think I need to play around with the fences and see if we can get this a little bit more streamlined. Okay, I've been playing on for a while and I've set this up a little bit more efficient. So there's two fences now that are containing each of the separate type of cuddlers or piglets in their own specific area. The normal cuddler producer is still hooked up to the elevator because we need to still produce normal cuddlers as well as producing the green ones. But it has a new pipe that takes some of the cuddlers directly to the other production machine and that produces the green ones. Oh, I've noticed as well the cuddlers will lick each other occasionally and that counts as a cuddle. So I don't need to do anything. They will have one of them will lick another one and then that gives them the heart and they just send themselves into the machine so job done so with that task complete i'm gonna call this episode done join me next time and we'll see what other creatures we can get our hands on i'm gonna keep going with this game until i've made a massive factory i'll admit i've kind of overlooked the factory production genre kind of games in the past and I think it's about time I really embraced it and see how big of a production line I can get going with this. But that's it for today. So thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed this one, drop a like for me because it really helps the channel out. And it helps me understand what videos I'm making work well and what ones don't work so well. Anyway, until next time, bye for now.